Welcome to Madison HD Sportsnet. We're here with head softball coach Mickey Dean. Mickey, thanks for joining us. Thank you. The Dukes just got back from a three-game sweep at Drexel this past week and talk about the performance. Well, you know, I thought our pitchers threw extremely well, which allowed our players to kind of relax a little bit. Um, and I thought our defense was very good. Um, Saturday we had some uh, miscues on in base running and uh, but overall, I thought it was a good weekend. Megan Good was named CA Pitcher of the Week, well deserved after a perfect game on Sunday and a shutout on Saturday. Talk about how she continues to grow as a pitcher and her performances from the beginning until now. Well, I've, you know, I've said it the whole time. I think uh, when you have two pitchers like Jalen and, and Megan and they're out there competing every day, it just makes each one of them that much better. And uh, Megan, on Saturday and Sunday, um, she just she had it all working. And uh, when you have it all working, now it becomes my job to make sure that uh, we're putting her in a position to 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 get every batter out. And uh, you know, you were there, so you saw we made a couple of nice defensive plays behind her too. So uh, she was the first to recognize you know, to her teammates after the game, and uh, she thanked them because uh, she did her job, they did their job, and. Uh, she ended up pitching a perfect game, which, you know, is fun. People take those things for granted. Uh, you know, no hitters are a little more common, but perfect games are very difficult. It takes a, a great deal of patience and focus. And uh, I thought she and her team did a really nice job of staying focused. There's some other exciting news for JMU softball with Jalen Ford and Erica Field were drafted into the National Pro Fast Pitch League. Talk about that as an accomplishment and what you see for both of their futures. Well, it, it's really nice to see two kids that work extremely hard uh, be rewarded for that work. And um, and again, sometimes you take those things for granted and uh, just their comments after the draft about, you know, ever since I was a little girl, this has been a dream of mine. And just to see those things come come to fruition, and um, it, it's very exciting. And it's exciting for our program uh, to have two kids go in the same year and uh, to two very good organizations. You guys have a big week coming up. You have UNC on Wednesday for a midweek matchup and then CAA for Delaware this weekend. Talk about what you ex expect from both of those teams. Well, we're going to get their best games. I mean, you know, UNC's in the top 40 in the RPI. They play a tough schedule. Um, and Coach Papa is a legend in the game. So, you know, they're going to be ready. Uh, Delaware has been playing extremely well, hitting the ball well, pitching the ball well. So, you know, it's just another week of softball, and uh, our key is to make sure that we go out and have a good practice today and take this game one pitch at a time and not, uh, not get ahead of ourselves. Well, Coach Dean, thank you so much for talking to us, and good luck this week. Thank you.